You're watching Shoot Your Shot TV, and today we have more Nike Book Ones. These are the Nike Book One Haven. If you're familiar with our channel or caught some of our more recent episodes, you might know I'm a big Nike Book One fan, so I had to get these. But before we jump into it, we want to give a huge shout out to 1985 Gallery for letting us get an early look at these. Let's go ahead and dive into the details. The Book One Haven comes dressed in all black with hemp and metallic bronze accents. At the top of the tongue, you have Devin Booker's book logo on a nylon tongue tag. On the opposite side, you do have this H in an old English font. The tongue consists of two different materials. At the top of the tongue, you do have this pony hair texture. And then for the rest of the tongue, you have this workwear canvas material. They come with flat black laces. And they do have another pony hair textured overlay going around the laces. As you get towards the vamp, you do have a Nike swoosh embroidered on in black. As you get to the toe box, you do have this suede material with perforated holes. Towards the tip of the toe, you have more suede overlays that take us to the side of the shoe. Taking us to the quarter panel, you do have this black workwear canvas. And on top of that, you have the Nike swooshes. I feel like this plastic material, and they do have this hemp marble swirl pattern, and then it's embroidered in metallic bronze. Taking us to the back of the shoe, you have this leather pull tab that reads 9-6, that represents Devin Booker's birth year. And on the back of that, it reads chapter one. Underneath that, you do have another suede overlay. Taking us to the midsole, you do have a black rubberized midsole. And on the inside of the shoe, you do have that Kushlaw material for optimal comfort. What you don't see within the midsole is a Zoom Air unit that's fully stacked for maximum comfort in the back of the heel. Taking us to the outsole, you have that translucent outsole with the herringbone traction, and it reads Air Zoom on the back of the heel. This latest book one pays tribute to Devin Booker's companion, his Kane Corso Haven. The black pony hair textured overlays are there to resemble his dog's fur, as well as that hemp marble pattern on the swoosh. They were inspired by Haven's eyes. You also do have that H in Old English on the back of the tongue, which is Haven's initial, instead of his family crest that we usually see on the other pairs. Some of the latest Book One colors that we've seen have been inspired by Devin Booker's love for the outdoors with the Nike Book One hike, as well as classic silhouettes like the Nike ACG Moab in the twine colorway. A dog is a man's best friend, so it's only right he came up with a colorway to match. The Nike Book One Haven will be available on April 6th. If you're in the San Francisco area, make sure you stop by 1985 Gallery. They always do first come, first serve. If you're not, they will be available on other Nike retailers. However, if you would like to purchase them right now, you can click our StockX link in the description below. Any purchase made helps support the channel so we can keep these reviews coming. Every little bit helps. As far as comfort goes, I've been wearing the Nike Book One for damn near 30 days straight now and they're really comfortable off the court. I haven't had the chance to play in them, but after those first couple days, they broke in really nicely. They're my go-to sneaker and I really love the comfort there. You can definitely feel that zoom air in the heel and I really love that extra padding in the collar and that padding on the tongue. As far as sizing goes, I do recommend going a half size up. They do run a little narrow, but like I said, they break in really nicely after a few wears. I am doing a 30-day follow-up on the Nike Book One Mirage, so if you want to know how that went, make sure you subscribe so you can be notified when that episode comes out. As far as style goes, I really love this silhouette. I think they really hit it on the head when they said they were setting out to make a future classic. It's very reminiscent of an Air Force One with just a little bit more comfort in there, a little bit more tech. Has that big swoosh, very similar to a blazer. And it's just a good looking silhouette with infinite color blocking options. I'm looking forward to more colorways. I haven't seen a color that I didn't like yet. So hopefully there's just more in the pipeline. But how do you guys feel about the Nike Book One Haven? Do you like the color blocking on these? Do you like the textured materials that they use? Let us know in the comments below. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button and that like button. We appreciate all the support. Let's go ahead and try these on. Shoot your shot records, let's fucking go. I'm back, yeah that feeling, I feel it. That shit that got me in it. Keep it real, I miss it. Nothing as real as this shit. Still on the mission for my meal ticket. They still complaining and they still bitching. Ill quit it. Instead of doing, they still wishing. They still tripping. I'm just built different. I'm still chilling, but I'm still building. I'm polarizing when I step outside. Feel like I got an extra life. Can't rest until my kids are set for life. Jesus, peace shine hella bright. Money give me devil eyes. Shit, I might go and put a rollie on that demon time. 
Nah, I don't do beef. For me, that's peace of mind. Nah, I don't start shit. That's how I sleep at night. With no regard for how they view me. If you ever had an issue, then lawyer up and sue me. I overdo it because they can't outdo me. I'm stiff with it and you can't outshoot me. Splash. If you enjoyed this review on the Nike Book One, make sure you check out all our other Nike reviews. We have a bunch for you guys to watch. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and that like button as well so you can be notified anytime new episodes drop. And we'll catch you on the next one.